In today's video, I will be reviewing the Super Goop Body Butter SPF 40 5.7 Fluid Ounces Broad Spectrum. Hi, I'm Melanie my mom. My friends and family call me Sean. Normally I film right back out here, but it's so sunny today that I'm inside. Also, I haven't filmed in a couple of weeks and I apologize. We've had a lot going on. People have been sick. I've been sick. My daughter was in the emergency room briefly. She's doing much better. She was in for dehydration. I apologize for no videos for a while. So I thought I'd jump in with one body butter. The, the name is already coming off of the label. Let me roll up my sleeve so I can show you what this looks like. This is a chemical sunscreen. It, it does, has no mineral sunscreens in it. It has avobenzone, 3%, octosalate, 5%, and octocrylene, 10%. Here is that. I have about this much left in here. I've used quite a bit of this. I've had it for a couple months. It's supposed to smell like vanilla. And it does. It smells like vanilla, but a very chemical vanilla scent. It comes out whipped. I love the texture of this. It is very whipped. It's almost like putting um, frosting, like a buttercream frosting from a cupcake, if you know what I'm talking about. And it feels so nice when you rub it in. Oh my goodness. This stuff. I love putting this on my legs. And I haven't seen anybody else do any reviews of this. This is an excellent chemical sunscreen. I've used it on my legs, I've used it on my feet, I've used it on my arms. I haven't received a sunburn, but you know me, <laughs> I, don't, I don't expose myself to a lot of sun because of my history of melanoma skin cancer, which is why I'm on the hunt for the best sunscreens out there which is why you should subscribe to my channel. I do sunscreen reviews, I do UPF clothing reviews, and I talk about skin cancer and how to prevent it. Cruelty free. It has a little bunny right there for the cruelty free. I would think that this would also be reef safe. Oh, it is. It is reef safe. No synthetic fragrance, but it smells like it has a synthetic fragrance to me. So I don't know about that. It's vegan, non-irritating. And it definitely is moisturizing. I love this on my body when I get straight out of the shower to just put this all over. I love this if I want to have a little bit of a vanilla scent. <laughs> it definitely is moisturizing. It's great as a hand cream. It's great as a body cream. I recommend if you're looking for a very moisturizing sunscreen, it's not waterproof. So don't go sweating or hopping in any water in it. What is the price point of this? Let's look that up. So this is $38. Is it worth $38? You get a lot of it. And I've been using it for a couple months now and I still have about this much left, but I don't use it every day. I do use this as like a luxury experience after like taking a shower. Let me know what other sunscreens you would like for me to review. I need some new ideas. And you all are the ones that I need to ask. So please leave your suggestions of sunscreens that you would like for me to review in the comment section of this video. I'll see you in my next one. Bye.